Hey everybody. Okay, so serious topic here. Um, I've been using my machine, you know, quite a bit lately, and I stopped um, to oil it, everything on it with a drop of synthetic oil. Any kind of oil is good as long as you oil your machine. And so um, I took the needle out to clean it, and it had this hunk of lint stuck around the needle. And then um, I have this uh, brush that is like actually a, a bottle, a straw bottle brush. And I stuck that down um, the needle tube after I uh, took the nipple off and I cleaned that out. There actually wasn't really anything in there. You can kind of um, spin the brush and just run the brush up and down after you take the needle bar out. So what I wanted to talk to you about today is something that I've kind of experienced this before. Look, we all know that we probably go too long between maintenance. So I took the nipple out and it's a number six nipple. Um, it's a Mauser number six nipple. Um, there's the number. And um, I'm using a number five needle. So I just took this nipple out and, you know, uh, to be honest, I can uh, see through it. See, there you go. I can see through it. So I'm like, oh, it's not too dirty. But look what happens when I try to put my, um, sorry, I'm having the cameras in my, when I try to put my number five nipple back through it, it's like, it doesn't go. Okay, it's barely coming out now. Look at how much force I'm having to put on this thing. Um, it's like basically, it's basically stuck now. Um, so... I just wanted to tell you that even though you think your machine is working okay, and I'm sorry the camera's moving, it may not be. So I gotta clean this nipple out um, and get it get it where the needle passes freely through it. I have a straight pin, and I'm gonna um, try to clean it out. And um, sorry, I can't see the phone is in the way of where I'm trying to look. But in any case, I'm gonna try to clean this nipple out and um, get all the lint out of it so that um, my number five needle will pass freely through it. But I guess I'm just kind of surprised. I mean, my um, my poor machine here, it was probably like kind of overworking itself to get the needle to go through the nipple that's part way clogged. But, but basically like, I mean, I'm telling you like, um, I uh, I can't even get this needle through, and it just like literally this needle just came out of my machine, um, and I was literally using it, and I was not experiencing any problems at all, but I just decided to stop and to clean my oil and clean my machine before I stop for the night. So um, I'm gonna put you on pause, and I'm gonna clean out this nipple, and I'll be right back. Okay, welcome back. So what I did was um, I tried to pick out the um, the lint with the, the needle and then I put this piece of yarn onto my needle and I ran it through my nipple and this is what came out of the nipple. It's, um, it's really not that much stuff but as you can see now my nipple um, freely rotates and moves on the needle. So um, I feel really bad because like my poor machine was having to overwork itself to get um, this needle to pass through this nipple and all that was in this was just this small amount and I'm not even kidding when I say to me the machine was working perfectly and um, I wasn't having any problems with it at all and I stopped to oil it and I'm like okay uh, nipple police here says clean out your nipples so I just I'm shocked that it, you know it, it wasn't plugged but the machine was having to use so much force to get the needle to go through the nipple like that's how you ruin your machines is just overworking them and not being nice to them so I I humbly submit that I have learned my lesson and you know if you're using your machine and you wait until you have a problem, you've gone like way beyond this. I wasn't having any problem with my machine, but just the power of the machine can overcome the um, the stuff in the needle. 
but why? Why make your machine struggle? Why make your machine overwork itself? So here's just a little advice, you know, please um, be nice to your machine, oil it and um, clean it out on a regular basis and really don't wait until there's a problem. Um, I'm, I'm surprised. I mean, in the past, sometimes I've waited till I've had an issue or whatever. I'm trying to be, you know, better about it and better to my machine. So, um, just wanted to kind of demonstrate to you what can happen with your nipple and how you really need to clean it. And um, you can see when I ran the yarn through, like just a little bit of stuff came off. But that was all that was in the nipple and that was enough to really make it clogged up. So um, hopefully y'all can, can do a little better and I will promise to be um, nicer to my machine in the future and clean out the nipple more frequently. Um, Okay, thanks y'all.